welcome to another video in today's video where I'm gonna be showing you how to work a car spawner in Roblox studio and how to put cars in them and everything like that first of all you're gonna need a plugin it's free it's gonna be called load character light the link is gonna be in the description you're gonna need that then you're gonna need also a model and it's going to be called Car Spawner A. Both links are going to be in the description. They're both free. Alright, now let's get started. So, don't mind the car. We'll need it later. Alright, so, the plugin you need to get, you're going to load character. And then you're going to put any character username you want. So, for my example, I'm just going to use my character. <clears throat> load it in. Just like that, my character is in. Now, we're going to go to Home Toolbox, and then we're going to go to My Models, the inventory of the four squares, and then there's going to be the car spawner. Right? If you have more models, then I'll probably show up more down here, but yeah. You're going to get it here. It doesn't matter how it looks right now. You're going to click the arrow. You're going to go to Screen Part. Get only Surface GUI, Screen GUI, and Open GUI. You're going to right cl click. You're going to cut or copy it. Depends on what you want to do. Delete car spawner or you can keep it. Me personally, I just delete it. Go into my character. And I'm going to paste it into there. There we have the three things. Then we're going to need something else. We're going to click plus on the character. We're going to search up click. You're going to put in click detector so we can click it, you know. Alright, now we're going to scroll down. This is screen UI. Press the arrow. Press or click scrolling frame where it says car I'm gonna get the name of the car that we're gonna spawn in just like that oh no I did not mean to do that we're gonna scroll down where it says car replace it do the same thing if you want more cars for this tutorial I'm just gonna do one car just like that now we're gonna press the arrow button on this and we're gonna go to text label Scroll down where is the text section, section, which is right here. You're going to go into text. And then at the bottom or near this area, you put the same thing as you did with while you replaced car. Name of the car. Put it like that. Just like that. Should be done with that. Now we're going to go to spawn button. Arrow. Put the arrow down. Now you're going to go into script. Double click. This dot crown vic, we're not gonna need this, so we're gonna put brackets. This, and then the car, the car name in the middle, just like that. And then that should be it for that. Now we're gonna grab the car, put in server storage, and then now we're gonna spawn it in. Just press play. Okay, now we're in as my character. Boom, we have a car thing, car menu. There's my car I want to spawn into. Spawn. It's gonna spawn where I put it. There you go. There's my car. Like that. There's my lights. Just like that. That's how you get car spawner. It works perfectly. If you have any issues or need support. Um, you can join my Discord, my YouTube Discord server in the description and make a support ticket. We'll try ace our best to get to you as soon as possible. And yeah, that concludes the tutorial on how to work a menu, or a car spawner menu, and how to put everything in. Hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all on the next one.